Okay, this is going to be kind of a short week. I uh, just want to show you two things. One will be how to use the LASP uh, plugins on your machine with also modular synthesizer, and then also how to hook the various knobs, sliders, uh, wheels, whatever, on your keyboard, your MIDI keyboard, the con or any control surface into the various little modules and, and control uh, the parameters of those. So let's get started. Okay, well here we are back in Alpha Modular, Alsa Modular Synthesizer, and I hope this looks familiar. This is the same setup we had uh, last week, so let's uh, start with this. I wanted uh, to show you this. Uh, how do we bind uh, the knobs on our MIDI control keyboard to various events? So let's let's go do that. Uh, we'll start with bringing up. Well, first let's let's just play the. So there's the, the native sound, and we'll come up here and view control center. And notice here are those five modules that you see. And here is the MIDI controller parameter. And nothing happens over here until I twiddle a knob. Now I'm going to twiddle the, the volume knob on my keyboard. And notice that it read it and came up. So let's come over here. And I'll take the volume knob on my control keyboard and hook it to gain on the PCM out module and I'll click bind. And now as I play a note, you can see that uh, the that was me moving the volume knob and you can see that that uh, controls the uh, the gain, the gain on the output. So let's try something else. Let's come down here to the uh, uh, MIDI control keyboard. And I'm going to tweak the pitch bend uh, thing on my MIDI control keyboard. And you see it says that's whatever it is, uh, type 13, channel 1, parameter 0. And I'll kick that to pitch and click bind. And now when I play a key, and hopefully you, you hear that. So that is how we uh, hook our MIDI control keys, the, the knobs, dials, sliders, whatever, on our keyboards or control surfaces to various events within, uh, within also modular synthesizer. Now, one other thing that I want to show you this week, because we could do it here too, is to come up here, and instead of going here to our modules that we've done before, is to show the browser for the plugins. And I'll come down here and pick the CAF multi chorus. That's a great one. I'm going to create a straight plugin. And there it is. And I will unhook this. Let's right click, disconnect, right click, disconnect, left click, left click, left, left click, left click. And I'll put over here. And this should be familiar to you from last week. Now let's go back to our control center. And notice I have the calf multi-chorus in here and let's pick our modulation rate and what I'm going to do here is I'm going to I think I'm going to go to my modulation slider that's a type 13 of, nope what was it parameter 1 modulation rate bind I'm moving it yep that's the one. So now let's try a key. Okay, 
okay, I cheated a little bit. I hit the uh, pitch bend as well. But anyway, that's that's all there is to this. Uh, you uh, bring up your control center. You uh, twiddle the knob that you're interested in. You click both of these, hit bind, and it binds to the to the feature. Uh, oh, uh, there is a uh, somewhere in here is a negative. Oh, toggle MIDI sign. Uh, there are things where if you increased the knob, you would want to decrease the effect. And if you toggle MIDI sign, then it will work backwards from, from what you think on that controller or from what would be natural for these kind of things. So that's pretty much all I wanted to show you this week, a quick one, because we've kept you so long in prior weeks. But that's it. Uh, again, uh, bring up your control center twiddle a knob link it to whatever you'd like in your plugins uh, if you're I mean in your plugins or modules if you want an additional uh, plug-in uh, there's your the events on your system and hopefully you can come through here and you will see that all the type plugins you have on your system the lats but ones are in here and we could go into phaser if we wanted uh, or flanger because you know I love those things but uh, we're not going to do it this time like I said I wanted to keep you a very short period of time so so that's it bind your events uh, show labs with browser see various plugins you can mess with all there is to it uh, I'll see you next week. Okay, well, that's it for this week. Also modular synthesizer. I hope that uh, uh, that, was, that was helpful to you. Uh, if your stuff doesn't act like my stuff, check the versions first. Otherwise, get involved. Check out the uh, extensive uh, examples and tutorials and demos in the, in the shared folder. And otherwise... Have a blast.